What's up everybody and welcome to my brand new Angular Tips series. Today I'm very excited to show you how to simplify code that uses Angular's input and host listener. As developers we often tend to put shortness over readability, but I strongly believe that readability should always come first. And today I'm going to show you a nice tip that not only makes our code shorter, it also improves readability. Input and host binding are two great Angular features. Input allows us to accept value in a component. Host binding will enable us to bind a value to the component's host. In our hello component, we display the name and add it as a value attribute to the component's host. If we open up the dev tools and inspect our hello component, we can see that the value attribute is added on the component's host. So this is done in the following way. First, we accept a name property which we then assign in the ng-oninit-lifecycle hook to a value property that then uses host binding to bind this property to an attribute value. This code is nice and it's working well. But can we simplify it? Yes, we can. Angular allows us to merge host binding and input into one property. So instead of having a name property and a value property, we can simply take this host binding part and put it also on the name. So our name is an input, but will also be bound to an attribute value. Of course, with this refactoring, we don't anymore need the second class property. And additionally, we can also get rid of our lifecycle hook, which is pretty cool. This code now does exactly the same, is much shorter, has less concept, is easier to read and understand. If you like this post and want to get more useful Angular tips, please subscribe below or follow me. See you next time.